Hey guys, how's it going today? Well, I got a couple things I want to show you. I don't do videos like this too often, but I'm going to have what we call a pass and a fail. And I'm going to bring the camera in just a little bit closer so I can show you exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, so now I'm back. Anyways, I've been doing some videos on water cooling, water cooling GPUs, CPUs, and I like to build a lot of my own water cooled setups. So I went online and I spent close to $100 for this Barrows. I don't even believe it's really a Barrows, but somebody printed Barrows on it, water pump. I went on to eBay and I bought this water pump by a company called Freeze Mod for $15, bear with me. So I got the barrels and spent about five hours trying to figure out how to get it going. And it came with no directions, period. So finally, after searching online for, like I said, close to five hours, I found one basically copy of a picture showing how this barrels pump is supposed to work. And it makes totally no sense to me because of quick overview on what pumps are supposed to do. Water pumps are supposed to carry water to your GPU or CPU. Normally they're set to full power. And they're also supposed to, they're supposed to do their job. They're supposed to be quiet and keep your system cool. So, once I finally found the directions for this fabulous Barrows pump, and I, I, I know Barrows makes some good equipment. This is why I find it even hard to believe that they made this. So, basically, you would think there's the power wire, right? Wrong. Not the power wire. I tried plugging this into everything. And then I noticed on the label, do not connect to the motherboard header. Why? Because this is basically some type of sensor, I guess. Okay. So, you got this little dial on it so you can ad adjust your flow which basically is kind of makes no sense when you want to keep your system constantly as cool as it can be. And if it's not a loud pump, you shouldn't worry about what it's pumping as long as it's pumping and doing its job. So you get this little adjusting button here, adjustment button. And then you got this big old Molex piece of junk. And then you have this little two wire sensor type thing and then you got this big six pin clip, which goes into here. So instead of connecting power and having a pump, which would just work power, like on this one, power, that's a sensor, I get it. Power, sensor, fine. Tells you your speed and temperature. Plug it in, it works. This one goes to your power supply. Connects to a Molex. This little one goes to your power plug on your motherboard, which needs an adapter that they do not send you. And it wouldn't matter if they did because you don't get directions so, then, so you know where to put it. So one is for temperature, one, one is for power, speed control. The other one is a sensor for temperature or something else. Anyways, why, I, I, fail, total fail. Why would anybody want to go through all the work and hassle of doing something like this? It's pretty well built. Why don't they just put a plug in there it gave you power and it pumped. Or a second one that gave you the little adapter if you wanted speed control. But you don't even get that. So, $100 later, $15 eBay. Sensor, power, filled with water, pumps. Works beautiful. It's quiet, it cools, and 
I, I just can't say how disappointed I am. This is going back. I, I am not going to even bother going through the hassle of hooking that up because if you got to break it down and go, then you got to take off your, your power button wire and it, it's just a big fiasco because you don't even get the little adapter to go with it. Never mind the adapter, you don't even get directions to show you how to do it. You're just supposed to guess. And good luck finding it online. So anyways, I don't do a lot of videos like this where I bash products. And I'm not bashing barrels. I'm just saying, really barrels, this is a totally bad idea. Really bad idea. Freeze mod. I'd give this pump a six, maybe, maybe a seven. The build quality is decent. It's quiet. It pumps up to 2,600 RPM. So it's giving you your average. It's got a simple plug for power and it's got a sensor for your temperature and your speed. That's about it. Very simple. So I'm going to give this one to the $15 freeze mod. Barrels, I'm giving you a fail. I guess this is what content creators are supposed to do, product reviews. So I'm going to do it. Anyways, just thought I'd jump in. I was bored at Sunday. Hope everybody has a great one. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up or a like on this video. And even if you have a comment and you know how to use this Barrows pump, maybe I'm missing something. Feel free, enlighten me. On that note, have a great day. Don't forget that thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. Take care.